because the GoPro decided to go on a little breaking holiday, well, I'm just doing this completely. If it works, let me just check whether that should be okay. Yes. Hi, my name is James and I am a CCP shill. Here we are. Well, I'm going to say everything is wonderful about China. It's a parody, okay? I'm just sick and tired of these shills, so I thought I'd just do the complete opposite. So here we are, Beijing. Look at this, lovely. No pollution at all. Nice clean air. It's always sunny. It never goes dark. It's just like this all the time. It's just a beautiful day in Beijing. Why do the Western media lie about the pollution when there's no pollution at all? Ha! Huh. I don't know. If we go to the northwest of China, to Xinjiang, where there's no genocide at all, nothing at all, no, everyone happy and dancing in squares, look at these happy people here, everything is fine. I don't know what the Western media is on about, they're just lying. Oh my God, why do they do it? I just don't know. What about this? In Hong Kong, the national security law, what, the, it's the best law in China, in Hong Kong. Um, look at this, look at all these happy people here. Fine, the police doing a fantastic job. All these criminals, these young criminals, oh dear. Um, these people are always happy. What about the internet? Oh my God, China has the best internet, the high-speed, fantastic internet. There's no need for international interference. That's why we decided to put on a firewall. Fantastic. So we can't get interference on Facebook, YouTube. But I don't know why. Some people do. They use a VPN. No need for a virtual private network in China. Everything. You have freedom. No worries at all. I remember going to Guangzhou a little bit earlier and went into McDonald's and I saw this sign. We can read the sign. We have been informed from now that black people are not allowed to enter this restaurant. Everything is fine. Of course, this must be some kind of propaganda from the Western media. Yep, that you're not allowed into this restaurant just because the colour of your skin. Oh, they must have they must have done some Photoshop to this. Oh no 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 that, that that's 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 wrong no, no 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 of course of course yeah thing here. And what about the South China Sea, the beautiful South China Sea here? Oh, it's so fantastic. International law said China cannot build any military bases. These islands don't belong to you. But China said, no, no, no. International law is completely wrong. Oh, no. China is 100% correct. And it's the South China Sea, so it's got to belong to the... Uh, the Chinese. So it's okay to build a military kind of thing there on these islands or build these man-made islands. So beautiful, so wonderful. China, international law is wrong. Chinese law is correct. My name is James. This is a parody and this is how the CCP Western Shields act. But the question is, mm, Mm. Here we are, here we are, here we are. The question is, how do they get paid? And I do know how you do get paid nowadays, but that's for another day. So, for the Barrett Channel, propagandists, everything is fine in China. Jason Lightfoot, living in China, young guy, little bit of a, a clown, can do some good stuff, but don't politicise, don't go down that road, just leave it out. Daniel Dumbrill, uh, just Daniel, um, Nathan, hmm, 
who else do we have? Jerry Good. All these people that say everything in China is fine and they are very good at manipulating. Propagandists. All Goebbels in themselves maybe are the grandchildren of <laughs> the propagandists of the German Empire around about 70 years ago. Joking aside. Just stating the facts and I'll leave it at that for this small ditty of a video. Sorry I'm rambling at the end. I'm sure you're not watching by now. Bye for now. Turn off camera.